Hey, what's going on, guys? Hello, everybody. This is Marvin. Amber and. And we're with, with the, the family. family. Oh, oh. <laughs> we, we might have to drop out one of our little cast members. She might have to get, do something else besides being in front of the camera if she can't be a good citizen. Can and, you be a good citizen? That's yes. a yes. All right. Anyways, guys, we're here for our weekly installment of House Hunters with the Family O. Mm -hmm. We're here in the Town Lake community. Mm -hmm. uh, it's waterfront property out here in Cypress, Texas. That they've actually it's a new development that's out here, and we're looking at three homes. Uh, various price ranges. Uh, the first home we're going to look at is a mid-level home mm -hmm. and you're actually going to see what one million dollars will buy you here in Texas. Yes. So I'm excited about that. What, what about you, Mom? Yes, I'm very excited also. Um, we are looking at the first home we're going to be looking at you guys is a Princeton home and it's going to have some different um, features that you haven't seen in some of our house hunting yeah. videos. So we're excited about that. Yeah, so we are going to get started. Um, if you appreciate these videos, if you enjoy this video, be sure to let, let us know in the comments which one you thought uh, we should have chosen. Uh, and if you enjoy the video as well, be sure to hit the thumbs up button. We always appreciate the love and mm -hmm. that's a good thing from a YouTube perspective. So we so appreciate the support and we so appreciate you rocking with us for each and every one of these videos. But we're going to head inside and take a look at the house. Peace. All right, peace. mentioning to you guys about I mean look at this this is so beautiful this is like a cellar wine cellar um, if we had this home we would definitely have our um, what do you call it <laughs> Bert, what's it called Martin Martinelli we would have it in here and although um, as I've mentioned before we don't drink alcohol um, I just it's something about a wine cellar that I think is so unique and classic looking and um, it's just beautiful. I love that you can actually sit in here and relax and even drink lemonade or we, we do drink tea. We're a tea family. So, um, you know, it's just very comfortable and cozy. And you can, um, right here, you can just close the doors. You know, if you had guests over, for example, and you want to just take a little break or, uh-oh, wrong way, sorry. You want to take a little moment, you can just close it off. And it's just so spacious, you guys. I just love it. You have your little wet, uh, wet bar over here. And your glasses that. that you can hang. And it's just really cool. I love it. So, you guys... That was quite an experience. You guys didn't get to see it, but as we were in the model home, the lady that was, um, I guess the sales lady, was saying that we couldn't take any pictures or any video. We have not heard that at any of the homes we've gone to, which there's always a first for everything, I suppose. Um, so at any rate, she was rushing us because there's another couple, she said, that was on their way, and I guess she's really trying to make that sale. Well, okay, we told her we were also interested in the home as well. Um, and she said, here's the information, the papers, you can look at it. And that was pretty much that. Well, you guys don't know this, but we don't deal well with disrespect, you know, and things of that nature. And we can take our business elsewhere. So that's what we're doing. So unfortunately, you guys aren't able to see the rest of the house. So we're going to move on to another house. funny how certain things you don't even think of until you see it and then you're like wow wow it's amazing and how many square foot is this home
Now this is a million dollar bedroom for sure. How you doing, Liberty? Tell everybody about this room. This baby, very nice guys, million dollar. Now let's take a look at the bedroom. All righty, this is insane, insane bathroom, insane. I mean, this bathroom feels like another, uh, I don't know, it feels like a garage in here. This is. Crazy. Crazy. Hey, now you know I'm normally not impressed by like these a big grand homes. Yeah. Hold on, baby. But this is in the house. This is awesome. Yeah. Stop. Let me take all of that. Like, we don't have to have all that. <laughs> Thank you, Liberty. You want to check it out, Mama? Let's get in the shower. Babe, you have to get this. Look, you drop down. This wow. Is like it's a drop down room. shower. Yeah. Check Crazy. And keep everything out. in. Look at the head. Okay, so we have a above head. What do they call this? A over uh, rain shower? No, a rain shower. This is over This is mowing too. We have mowing at home. Crazy. Wow. Look at the closet. Look, spacious closet alert. Spacious closet alert. This is really nice. Wow. Liberty oh, okay. says it has hangers. Oh, that's my Wow. Crazy. Crazy. <laughs> ridiculous backyard. I mean, the amount of space and the fact that you get a shot of this, you're right here on the water, is incredible. I mean, for the liberty. I mean, this is just, now of course 1.2, 1.2 million, you know, will get you, should get you something like this, but even, you know, even still, I mean, this is still a crazy, crazy, crazy uh, backyard. It's right on the water. You've got great space, but your actual uh, living space in the backyard is incredible as well. Gas barbecue, full-fledged living room out here, as well as an outdoor, I guess this is like a meeting area deck or something right here. I mean, where you can literally have 10, 10 to 12 people out here. It's super easy. So, I'm impressed to say the least. Let's check out the rest of the house. So you know, how you guys doing? Hello. This is beautiful. Very, very space. I love the tall ceiling. It's inside. And let me show you in the closet. Libby's saying, uh oh. Libby's saying hi to the book. Excuse me. Look, babe. I like the. Now, these are my stats. Wow. Really nice. And then the only thing in here is that um, this one needs to be a bathtub for Libby. This is a shower. Mm -hmm. I want a bath so where she can take a shower or a bath. For right now, a bath and then a shower later. So it'd be like a guest. Mm -hmm. Hello. Yeah. Let's see if we can find another bedroom on the school. I'm grown. I don't need to hold nobody here. I'm grown. Wow. Okay. Here's like an upstairs uh, game area. Or you can play cards or dominoes or whatever the case may be. All right. Okay, here is a, I believe this is a third or fourth bedroom. Now here's that faux brick that I was talking about. Now in our last house hunting video, uh, that was actually real brick. This is faux brick. Because if you feel it, it feels like brick, but it's, I can tell that it's a wood background, but sweetie, this is the, this is the faux brick. See, I, I had a little faux, a faux paw in our last video, <laughs> but this is actually faux brick right here. Baby, this is still real, isn't That's it? That's not real. It's not? Uh-uh. Oh, wow. They did a great job. It's too hollow. Oh, okay. It's too hollow sounding. Okay, go put that back. Look at the All right, closet. let's take a look. Oh, there's another room. Now I don't know if this is just a middle middle living room because it's a million dollar home. It's a, just a, a living room. Uh-uh, come this way. It's just a living room in the middle for the sake of a living room. Oh, this is well, this could be Libby's um learning room. This would be perfect. 
You got you got one point two million dollars. Yes, my father does. Ooh, is he da 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 Definitely a media room, not a theater room. As you guys remember in the previous videos, um, there's a big difference between the two. Hey, Jamie Foxx, what up, Jay? What up? Liberty, this What's this guy's name? I forget his name. Um, Colin Firth? No, he ain't Colin. No, I know he's an actor. Now. Yeah, he's a new guy. I forget his name. He was in Save the Last Dance. That is not him. Bro. That ain't him? Really? That is him. No, that's the guy. Um, I can't think of his name, but I know him. We'll figure it out. I'll put it in the comments, I'm sure. Someone will check me in the comments. Oh, that's added. Okay. Yes, beautiful. Not much of a, not much of a media room area. Now, for 1.2, I did expect a little bit more than this, but. You know, it's still okay. Set of stairs. This upstairs. is really cool. This goes down into a bedroom. Another Look, bedroom. Liberty upstairs, upstairs by the way. Hey, Lib. Oh, Ooh, wow. Look at the walk in closet. See, I, see, oh, I this like is crazy. This. Well, she could be downstairs temporarily, and then we can bring her upstairs. Right? If you don't put that down. Look at it. Put it down. Put it. This is an old fashioned perfume bottle. I love that. Okay. Right, nice, nice size closet. All right, we ready to go to the next house. All right. What? what do you like about this house, though, Mom? Everything. Come here, Liberty. Liberty, stay down here with us. Um, this house is beautiful, you guys. This is David Weekly. I don't know if Babe mentioned it a moment ago or not, but it is gorgeous. It really is. And it has a high price tag, but it really, it really shows. Like, it just has so many things that you don't even think that you would need. So many cupboard um, spaces. Um, just from the design in general of the home, it's so beautiful. Um, one thing that is interesting though is it doesn't have a double oven, which I would have thought um, that it would have that, but it doesn't. So I don't know, but it's beautiful, however. Double oven? Yeah. Finally. If you don't put that, get off them lights. Wow, this is cool. I like this. Wow. This is so unique. This is like touch. It looks like it's touch. Oh, this is cool. Oh, touch screen oven. Wow. Yeah, this is really cool. I love it. Yeah, this one actually had the second kitchen, you know, proposed to do real spicy food, cook fish and all that. Uh, we're the one across from the weekly model, uh -huh. they're they're putting even another grill on everything. Oh, wow. This is very custom I can tell. It's, I haven't seen anything quite like it. Like it. Very unique uh, thing. Even look at the fireplace. Yeah. Yeah, and this home only has the rooms of about a 3,500 square foot home, but it's, it's all spread out. Spread out. And, uh, and it's a lot of, a lot of like, entry space. Yeah. If that's something you like, we can incorporate it into any layout. This is your room, girl, please. This is not your room. This would be mommy and daddy's room. your room. She just done deboed our room. Alright, let's take a look at this bathroom. Okay. Nice size bathroom. That's very gaudy with the light fixtures. Check out the gaudy light fixtures. It's bedazzled with bling. Oh yeah, I heard it say it was her bedroom. Told her she would lost her mind. It's very gaudy. Yeah. Definitely a dog. Very grandiose. Wow. Another overhead shower. Oh, wow. Look at the closet. 
take a look at the closet. Ooh. Oh, this is nice. Wow. I love the built-in. Sick built-in. So built -in. Sick built-in alert. Sick built-in alert. This is a wrapping stairs. Scary for Liv. This is scary for me. Ooh. She done took off already. Okay. Hold on. Slow down. Okay. Nice little media, I guess, game room. This is a nice closet. Come on this way. Slow down, slow down, slow down. All right, let's go this way. Very nice. Okay, nice little bedroom here. This is nice. This is nice. I love the shutters again. A little Jack and Jill. Is this a Jack and Jill? Let's sing it. Looks yes, like it sir. Liberty, this way, baby. Lights is off because they're this about to close. Like Ooh. I know that this is real hot to count. Okay. Here's the second bedroom here. It's my bedroom. Oh, this is cute. All right. Come on, baby. I think we are done. Let's see. Ooh, it's dark. That's a day bed. Look at this. <laughs> so this home has no media room. Mm -hmm. That's quite That's interesting. Mm -hmm. For a million dollars, I need about two, three million <laughs> media rooms. <laughs> yeah. Okay. All right. We're gonna roll. All right. Come on, Libra. Okay, guys. We are done with our house shopping. Yes, um, this is a quicker episode because we've never been kicked out of a home before. <laughs> I guess it's, it was bound to happen at some point. Um, but anyways, we do this for you guys uh, yeah. to show you guys, you know, just what your options are. Yeah. Regardless of where you live, there's something similar in one of these homes that we've been looking at. And um, we want to give you an idea, especially if you're in the Texas area, of what you can buy if you've ever thought about relocating. Like, so if you're wondering what house we picked, um, what house did we pick? The house we picked is house Number, number two. two, the David Weekly House. Yeah, we really like that home. Mm -hmm. I think overall it had everything we were looking mm -hmm. for. Um, the media room was okay, um, but it was there, it was present. Mm -hmm. So for me, that's got it's a must, must have. Exactly. In a home. And especially when you get up in that price range. That's right. Now with the third home, we really liked that home. Um, it did um, not have a media room, which we thought. Mm. Are you okay. <laughs> we're video. Mm -hmm. Say hello. Mm -hmm. Have a good one. Thank you. Have a good one. That's good. real life, y'all. Yes, Thank dude. you. Love it. We love it. <laughs> real life, you guys. <laughs> but anyway, Photo um, bomb. yeah. So this, um, the last home, which was a custom home. Yeah. Um, uh, oh, I lost my thought. I'm sorry. Oh, it did not have a media room, yeah. which is quite interesting. I mean, it's a custom home, so. Mm -hmm. To be competitive, I think in today's housing markets, especially when you're at the higher tier price mm -hmm. ranges like these homes were, mm -hmm. a, um, a media room is a must. Exactly. A must. Yeah, and, and actually... Um, it's as important as a bathroom. Yeah, they, they do have other plans that the gentleman, um, Mr. Rick, was kind enough to let us know about. So we'll definitely be out to look at more homes. Yep. Um, but for me, this particular home was a little bit too custom. And mm -hmm. what I mean by that is um, it just had a lot of... It just kind of didn't flow as nicely as the David Weekly home or even the first home that we saw some of it just didn't right. flow as nice so um, yeah that's our choice you guys house number two you guys have to let us know yep. if you agree with us if you felt the same way yep. or um, you know what do you think about the price do you think that the million dollar home were worth what you saw um, or do you think you could have got a little bit more? Yeah. Depending on where you're watching this, a million dollars might not even be an apartment. Mm -mm. Especially on the East Coast. Yeah, on the East Coast. We but, know it's quite expensive there. But as always, guys, we appreciate you rocking yes. with us. Um, be sure to let us know in the comments what you thought about the video. Mm -hmm. And we will check in with you guys next week. All righty. A fresh set of homes. Hopefully we don't get kicked out of any of them. <laughs> so we can do a full three because today was like two and a half. Two homes. and a half, yeah.
Because we but, gotta kick that But home. I have a little secret to tell you guys, by the way. I had been to this home before, so. You have? Yeah, I oh. had been. Remember I told you? Nah, I don't remember that. Yeah, we had been here before. Well, I had a friend come to town one time, and she loves house hunting as well. And we oh yeah, you remember? I remember, yeah, I remember. Yeah, yeah. So, right. so we we saw it. So honestly, we made the right decision. We did. Yeah. All right, guys. Peace out. Thanks peace. for checking out the family. Thank you. Yo. Please subscribe to the family. Oh, and share.